Hey guys, thanks for joining me, my little breadboard build for the receiver section of the uh, isolated Bluetooth receiver, again with the one volt solar cell. One thing interesting about the solar cell, if you see in the uh, picture in picture that I'm sharing, I've got fluorescent lights in two different locations above me. And what happens with the fluorescent light, the UV light inside the uh, light tube fluctuates at 120 times per second. So you can see on the scope here, I've got a nice 120 hertz signal. I can leverage that signal. We can turn this into a, a capacitor outside foil or outside shield detection circuit by feeding the 120 hertz signal in and measure the signal at this point and determine the um, orientation or the outside foil location. It's a, a simple and easy method if you don't want to build one of the other circuits that are available. Let me get things set up here. Attach the uh, probe back to the binder clip. Again, we're just sniffing the uh, signal on the outer side of the capacitor. The other side goes to ground again. Our 120 hertz uh, signal coming in. We'll go back up here to the uh, scope. Let me reposition the camera. And you can see the amplitude of the signal with the uh, capacitor oriented in this configuration around 95 millivolts. Let's change the orientation of the capacitor and double check and see if the signal increases or decreases. Let's go back to the scope and you can see the big increase in signal. Now about 231 millivolts. So with a higher amount of signal to the left, that indicates this is the ground or the outer shield of the capacitor. Again, when we ground that or change the orientation and have this side going to ground, we have uh, less signal. So you could look at it uh, either way. Again, the highest signal oriented toward the uh, capacitor, the signal input being the uh, ground or outer, outer shield and just the opposite again. If we change the orientation and have the least amount of signal going to ground would be the outer foil. Here's the uh, simple circuit with one modification to the preamp. I changed the uh, 1 2.2K resistor to uh, 4.7K. Let me uh, flip the overhead lights out and I'll show you how the uh, 120 hertz signal goes away. Here's the uh, first fluorescent light and the second. So a pretty cool uh, noise source that can be used in lieu of a signal generator or just using your fingers to pick up the 60 hertz signal. Thanks for watching.